my gorgeous peoples. Tonight I have a um, looks just like a jack-o'-lantern bath bomb and this is from Boiling Bubble and um, this is a hoard from last year as well. I opened up a box and I'm like oh my gosh all these Halloween bath bombs. So um, yeah it smells sort of like cinnamony so it's not a bakery scent so I'm happy with that. <laughs> This foam is crazy. Look at that. It's so vibrant. Yep. So vibrant and um, thick. I don't know if this is going to have an embed in it or two <laughs> at all. Um, yeah, I have no idea, but I know it's going to be a gorgeous bath because usually um, there is really pretty bath water with this company. I might as well let it go at this point because it seems like it's only orange. So let's go ahead and see what happens. It's not him, bud. So colorful. It just is perfect for fall. have made the little caverns as I call them. The little caves. Oh, it is so um the embeds are so dick look at that. That's no wonder it's coming out seriously because it's like a lot of embed in there. Let's see about this crush. Oh, I think I've had it too long. It will not crush easily. Alright, so let's take a look at the water. Okay. It is very deep orange. Um, but I must say, it doesn't have as many, as much shimmer as I expected to based on the um, bath bombs that I've gotten from them before. But maybe it was intentional because this is a Halloween bomb. I really was expecting tons of shimmer. However, trust and believe, most of her stuff is shimmerish. All right, guys, that's it for this back from Boil and Bubble, and I will talk to you guys on the next one.